Hey, it's your boy Crypto Expert Life back with another video. In this video, I'm going to talk about, uh, I guess, what happened to Dino BUSD. I want to do a uh, closing video, let's say. Okay, so let's roll that intro and let's get into the video. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. You know what to do hit that subscribe button and bell notification. So when I upload my latest vids, you can get notified immediately. All right, guys, so I actually did a video on this on June the 23rd, which is now the date today is the 21st of August, June, July, August. So basically this thing lasted two months. What what has happened to it now? It is uh, basically it's drained. The contract is drained. This is the contract here. And um, it's gone skeets, okay? which was always going to happen. Um, in this initial video that I did, I said, uh, this thing is like an ROI DAP. If you don't get in early, um, you know, it's gonna, it, you're basically, if you're not in the first minute, uh, you're basically gonna lose your money because the first people that get in, they can withdraw first. That's how these ROI DAPs work. And then what happened was later on, um, this thing actually pumped and it surprised me a lot, um, but I knew that it was always going to uh, die. But I was very surprised because it initially in the first, it started off slow. It only went to about 30 or 40K. And then it, about a week, week later, it went to 100K. And I'm like, whoa, this is un, um, unusual. And then about let's see here the june the 23rd if we go here i found a video um here on august the 4th so still a month and a bit month and a half later this thing had 600 i think i don't know exactly how much it went up to i, I did see it at about 700k i just couldn't find a video on it but this video here by um this youtuber you can see the balance here, 665000 And I thought, this is crazy. There's people investing money in this thing. Um, and the only way that people would have uh, found out about this thing would have been through you know, YouTube is pumping it. All right. And then what happened was um, here to the, uh, this video, which was done yesterday. No, it was done three days ago, four days ago. Um, this guy here, he's basically said that they basically rocked, right? If we have a look at his video, just get straight to the point. The Dino BUSD is gone. As you can see here in the contract, it's no money. Disappear. I will. That's, that's pretty much it. <laughs> so he, he summed it up in the first, what, you know, 30 seconds. Um, so we have to, we have to kind of like what what went wrong with this thing well i had a look at the contract i mean basically from judging from the contract is that uh the, the people that invested it early um whether it was the devs whether it was the um initial investors they were basically able to take their money out but the thing with this uh contract is uh you you could actually withdraw Go back to this video here. You could actually withdraw your initial balance. And I think this is where this was uh, kind of like went wrong. Um, yeah, I mean, I've never invested in it. Um, but yeah, this is kind of like where it went wrong because you could withdraw your balance, um, your initial balance. And I guess everyone kind of just took their money out. <laughs> Um, you know, uh, and that's, that's where it just fell apart. Uh, obviously the, 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 the people that got in first, they would earn the most and then they could, um, take their money out, um, uh, so, like sooner. Right. So you can see here, this guy here, what did he invest? User invested. Okay. So this guy invested three, wow. This guy invested 3,000. Um, one hundred and twenty-one dollars, and his ROI was two hundred fifty a day. What did he end up withdrawing? 
total withdrawal was 461. So this guy basically lost, well, he had some referral commissions, but yeah, he basically lost 2,000. Oh, my mouth is bad. It's early in the morning. <laughs> but yeah, uh, probably about 2,600 he lost. Um, which is, uh, I mean, I would never invest this type of money into uh, these type of ROI dApps. They just, they just high risk. They just, uh, it's just a dumb move, in my opinion. But people are doing it. You know, that's <clears throat> that's their call. They got to live with the consequences. Um, but you know, these things are not long term. You, you know, these things are not long term. Um, you got to ask yourself, why do YouTubers never talk about these high risk projects on their channel? weeks or months later well it's, it's simply because they're, they're not around um that's that's the truth because they don't last and they take your money okay so this this all these roi dapps they're all designed to basically take your money okay the people that run them um either if they're not scammers or they're like legit um they'll make a healthy profit because these guys here were still making a 2% withdrawal fee um, and this deposit fee initially they did not tell you until they were called out and then they announced it so that was a bit of deceitful um, this on their part in the early beginnings I think then they disclosed it about a week later until you know these devs they, they, they're silly they think that people don't know um, uh, what's going on right because there's people that can read contracts so they were making they were still making like six percent marketing fee and the dev fee was six percent on all deposits and then the withdrawal fee was two percent so they were still making money whether it was them that rugged or not i don't know i mean you know so from what i saw i think it was about 600 it was more than 600 uh 700 it was like maybe 750 but that I didn't follow this. I just saw this periodically. I you know log in every now and again. Um, times what's that? Six percent withdrawal fee and two percent. Let's just say eight percent, right? Times zero point zero eight percent. So that would have made sixty grand just on the fees. That just tells you. That just goes to tell you that that's a lot of money to take out just on the fees. So you can. You know, just the fees alone will tell you that this thing's not going to last long. Um, and, uh, you know, this available withdrawal, this claim was not real. I mean, I mean, you could claim, but you wouldn't get the money. <laughs> Normally, when you hit a claim button, it's like, hey, you know, what? I can withdraw my money. No, the claim just meant you just claim it and they just moved it to a different um, box. And then you had to wait um, to withdraw. And in, even when you withdraw, you, you would only get 50 percent. <laughs> OK. So, so that was all the little things that they put in place. And then they had this thing where I believe you could take out your initial investment. Um, so the moral of the story is this. These things don't last. They, they If you, you're kidding yourself, if you're going to put your money in this thing and you think it's going to last. I also found this other video on this guy here. And he's like, he found... Um, this BUSD. So maybe these guys have got multiple. I reckon they would have multiple uh, platforms. See, because all they need to do is to just to get the initial um, scrum script, fork it, put up a new website, put up a different color scheme and a new logo. And that's exactly what we have here, right? So here we got this. Somebody in the comments said, "Oh, what?" space usd so he's found like i don't even know these existed but he's found um all these other different ones right so then he goes to the next one this one here see i don't know what that's called soccer busd so you can see obviously right it's the same template see it's the same template just different color scheme and different logo um so are these guys behind it? It wouldn't be hard for them to just fork it and just put up a new website and get people to invest um, to get into these things, right? Because they've done it once, so they will just keep on doing it again. Because um, they don't forget, no matter what happens to the platform, they're still going to get 8% out of everything that goes through these platforms. And they don't care. They just want to um, they want to make money at the expense of other people. So... Uh, <laughs> 
I, I, I've seen this so many times. It's just, um, it's almost hilarious. I mean, I, I feel sorry for those people that um, lose money. But then again, I don't really feel sorry for them. I don't, I don't have pity for them because, um, you know, you guys know what you're already getting into. This thing is high risk. Don't be naive and think that you're going to make all this money um, uh, and you're putting in thousands of dollars. It's the dumbest thing you can ever do in crypto because, as you can see, these things do not last they are simply uh, just, um, what's the word, smoking mirrors. And initially in my first video, I said that, right? I said that. Then and then later when it went to 700K, I'm like, okay, maybe I'm wrong about this. You know, maybe it's, it's going to go on longer than I thought. I mean, I always knew that it was going to die, but then... Uh, I said, okay, because initially in my first video, I said that this is only going to last a month because that was the window with the withdrawals and it went longer than a month. So that's when, in, you know, later in subsequent later follow up videos, I said, okay, okay, maybe I'm wrong about this. I'm wrong about it lasting a month. It's still around two months later. Then uh, all of a sudden it came to a, a <clears throat> abrupt stop um, with the, uh, with the rug um, so now it's like, you know, I logged in this morning and I looked at the contract. So that's why I'm making this video. It's just, it's not so much to, it's, it's just that it, this is important to understand how these things, what happens to these things, because I'm all about the education. I'm all about, you know, people, um, um, understanding the risk of these things, not to put, you know, tons of money into this and just know that the, at the end, it's inevitable what's going to happen, okay? There's a lot of new people that get into this stuff and they listen to a YouTuber and then they're just like, oh, I'm going to put, you know, they're sold on the idea, they put, you know, thousands of dollars in and they learn the hard way. So that's it, guys. Uh, if you're going to engage in this type of thing, just know that uh, it's all going to end. It's going to end bad and you could, lose your money if you're not the first person in and keep in mind too a lot of these youtubers they're making money off the referral commission so they don't care whether you put in thousands of dollars they're going to make their money initially when you make the deposit see so they don't care what happens to the project so uh look that's all i can say i think we're done here thanks for watching please subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video Hey guys.